let's take a look at how we can add new item templates to the side waffle template packs um, I have already forked and cloned the project uh, on github down to my uh, own computer and uh, I've loaded it up here in Visual Studio it's basically just a simple um, project and what we want to do is that we want to add a new item template and I want to add an item template for humans.txt which is sort of a, a novelty among web developers uh, for those who knows about it. Um, it's sort of the opposite of what robots.txt is, uh, so to speak. Um, so let's just take a look in the item templates folder. We have some folders here underneath JavaScript and MISC and basically this is just for organizing so this has actually no impact on the outcome of um, you know, where the folders, or sorry, where the templates are placed um, in the add new item dialog and so on. Um, this is just for organizational purposes. And then we get down to it here. Here is my robots.txt. There's an icon, there's uh, the actual template itself, and then we have some definition files. Now these definitions are um, on a naming convention, so if you're gonna you you have to kind of stay with these names. Don't change any of these names. So in order for us to add our humans TXT, I'm just going to find the already existing item template that looks most like it. And in this case, it's probably robots TXT. So I'm just going to copy the folder and paste it in. And uh, I'm just going to rename it to humans TXT. And I'm going to rename this file as well. So let's open this, shall we? And I have some better text, more suited for human 60. Get that in there. I have another icon here. So this is from the humans.txt.org website, their logo. So let's add that. So now we have it here. And the only thing I then need to do is to change the definition files. They are almost identical, but there are some important differences. But let's just uh, dive in here humans.txt just gonna rename and this is gonna be my description I'm gonna change this guy down here to humans.txt as well so this project item points to this file so notice how it uh, it doesn't use uh, this syntax to kind of go above uh, you know out of the folder and here and that's because of the special build system that we have in this project so um, that's why that looks the way it does so that was one file that was the c-sharp one up here and I just copied these three things because they are exactly identical across all of them so let's do that and we're just going to change this to humans here and the final one and that's it and the only thing I need to uh, to test that this works is basically to hit F5 or control F5 so let's try it so now the build process have created the v6 automatically and loaded it into uh, the experimental instance as you can see up here in the top um, and I can just open any web app here be it a web app or a website and uh, if we go here and say add new item control shift A we should be able to find humans txt and here it is so it's as simple as that so I hope that you're gonna add a lot of templates to the side waffle template pack it couldn't be easier and it's going to reach a lot of people um, so uh, please keep the pull requests coming thank you